folks, it is Friday. We have finally made it to the end of the work week. For some of us, it is a fairly stormy one uh, out there as we do have a storm system that uh, is still impacting Atlantic Canada, especially those of us in Newfoundland. And that is where our weather story begins for today. Uh, the snowfall forecast for Newfoundland and Labrador. Uh, we're still looking at uh, some uh, measurable snow for some areas. Uh, across the Avalon, uh, down through uh, along the south coast, not a whole lot of snow of expect, uh, not a lot, not a whole lot of snow is expected. Uh, but you can see Gander, Grand Falls, Windsor, Corner Rope, looking at a further five to ten centimeters throughout the day on Friday. We're going to see some gusty winds for some areas as well. Up the Great Northern Peninsula, about two to four centimeters expected for both Port Saunders and for St. Anthony and uh, Channel Port of Ass uh, on the south coast, probably going to pick up about five to ten centimeters of snowfall as well. Eastern Canada today, uh, we're going to see some drizzle actually over the Avalon. Uh, the rain will come to an end, we'll see drizzle and fog. Uh, fairly warm with a temperature of 9 degrees expected for, fr for Friday. Rain or snow expected in central Newfoundland. Back along the west coast, we are still looking at uh, snowfall, a chance of showers in Labrador City. And uh, even Charlottetown and Sydney still holding on to that uh, mixed uh, precipitation. We're looking at some flurries in Charlottetown and some rain expected in Sydney. And you'll notice we will see a clearing trend throughout Halifax and Fredericton for your Friday. Central Canada, we're looking at some snow in eastern Quebec, a uh, chance of flurries for uh, southern and southwestern Quebec, chance of flurries in the nation's capital as well. Uh, back across southern Ontario, fair skies expected. Fair skies expected in uh, northern Ontario, Sudbury, zero degrees. Thunder Bay, looking at some snow and one degree. And it's not only on the uh, east coast that we are seeing a storm, it is, it is also going to be a fairly stormy day for uh, portions of Saskatchewan today. Uh, in fact, some areas could pick up a further 5 centimeters of snow, uh, 10 centimeters expected in some areas. We did see snow move in overnight on Thursday. It's going to continue for most of the day today. Uh, the winner, if you want to call it a winner, uh, will be uh, Regina with about 10 centimeters of snow expected. 5 centimeters uh, up toward uh, Prince Albert, 5 centimeters for Yorkton, Saskatoon, and Swift Current as well. So the weather forecast for Western Canada, we're looking at fairly overcast skies in Winnipeg, and there's that storm. We're going to see heavy snow uh, for Regina with some blowing snow, and some snow and blowing snow expected in Saskatoon as well. And then uh, taking a look at um, Alberta, we're looking at uh, some snowfall in Fort McMurray, about 5 to 10 centimeters expected there as well. And uh, a sun and cloud in Edmonton, mainly sunny skies expected in Calgary, daytime high of 5. Back across the west coast, there is the risk of seeing some thunderstorms, believe it or not, today for the BC Lower Mainland, Vancouver, and Victoria temperatures uh, nearing the uh, 10 degree mark. Slight chance of uh, seeing some thunder showers, but the risk exists nonetheless. And that is your national weather forecast for your Friday. Have a phenomenal Friday and a fantastic weekend.